Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. A little more Blood Red Skies for you. So we picked up some of the new U.S. releases here just to round out some of our aces. So the new one here, we got U.S. ace pilot David McCampbell. We're going to get this open for you guys, take a look at the plane uh, and the pilot cards and all that stuff, and uh, show you guys all the details here. We'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. We got everything unboxed here for you. So again, we get quite a bit of stuff here. The... Pilot uh, base um, uh, plate here, so David McCampbell. And again, if you just want to run a generic ace, you always have that too. We got our decals, the flying base. We'll take a look at the plane in just a second. The plane itself, so again, the Hellcat, one of my favorites, but again, just fantastic stats. So two firepower, two for the maneuver, and a speed of eight with a real speed of 380. Traits are rapid, roll, and robust. And just your basic. Hellcat clocks in at 39 points for the plane, so definitely a little bit more on the expensive side, but also great quality, and from uh, 1943 onwards. So the traits again, rapid, roll, and robust. I think for some reason, um, less, unless there's something I'm not seeing, but they included a great dive card in here, but um, doesn't seem like any of the other cards give you a great dive for free, unless I've missed something, so... We are going to basically pull that one out. I think that is a mistake on their part. Correct me if I'm wrong, though. Drop a comment. But let's take a look at Robust. It's pretty cool here. So in reaction uh, to a Robust plane being shot at, basically just reduce the number of uh, dice rolled for the attack by one. So, you know, if you have that, of course, hopefully less likely to incur some damage. Then Rapid Roll on an airplane during its activation. And again, just as an aeroplane doesn't specify specifically uh, this one, but nonetheless, um, the aircraft may make its normal 45 degree turn at either the beginning or end of its movement. So pretty neat stuff there, hopefully letting you get out of harm's way or setting yourself up for some good subsequent action there. So all in all, some pretty cool traits for a already formidable plane. Now... Dave McCampbell himself, signature trait, so an extra firepower, which is already going to be fantastic, given the fact that he's an ace. And again, his special uh, ace skills are accurate and eagle eyes. Of course, he's pilot skill five. Eagle eyes is a nice one. So on a friendly ace, uh, choosing the outmaneuver action, and basically you can outmaneuver an enemy plane up to 12 away. So uh, that's a pretty impressive bit of territory to be able to do that. And certainly something that the opponent is going to have to factor in with their movements just because of the just the that much bigger sort of um, space that he can uh, pull that maneuver off and so that's going to hopefully force them to adjust some of their maneuvering as well and lead them into some mistakes that you can capitalize on accurate play, play on an ace during the activation and they roll an extra firepower die when they make their shooting attack which goes really nice with his signature trait already where it's already plus one firepower and then the fact that he's pilot skill five of course and then the plane, right? So that's a that's a lot of uh, dice being thrown there. Now, the reverse of his card, we're going to just slide that out of the way. Take a look here. So he's got a pretty cool backstory as well. But he's going to run you 135 points. So, you know, obviously you're going to pay a premium for these named aces. But again, given some of the things that he comes built with, right? The eagle eyes and accurate. And then another firepower on top of everything. That's already... It's taking this already formidable plane and really just taking it to the next level. So, and then the plane itself. So again, that Warlord resin. So good details all around, all kinds of panel lines. Take a look at the bottom here. And essentially no deformities. cockpit there so pretty good stuff overall again correct me if I'm wrong in the comments guys but I don't believe that great dive goes in this so I think that's just a mistake on the packing but anyway pretty cool ace here so again always nice to see some new toys for the game and the US getting some again of their just uh, increasingly better and better planes as the war progressed and some of the corresponding aces to make them just that much deadlier. So let us know in the comments, guys, if you have been enjoying the Hellcats for the game and if you've been running McCampbell at all um, and how he's been performing for you. 
and uh, just what what are some of your typical lists that you've employed with him and or the Hellcats uh, in, in your uh, selection. So hit us up in the comments there, guys. We've got some more coming for you soon. And thanks so much as always. Like and subscribe, and we'll be back for more.